Hello there, people of the internet. It is Saturday morning. Bright and uh, I guess it's really not that sunny. Very overcast. But it's nice and bright outside, so that's nice. This place is like a total disaster. Look at this. We're gonna spend a lot of the day at the new apartment. Get doing some painting and stuff, so. Something to look forward to. Here she is. <gasps> Who's wearing a bow in her hair? Who's got a bow? Yeah, you do. We just picked up the crib and it takes up the entire back seat. I was thinking that it would fit with Revlin in it, so we were gonna bring Revlin. Good thing we did it because literally it takes the whole back. Yep, no room for her. No way. <laughs> so yeah, thankfully she actually went right down for a nap before we left. So Tim, Tim's watching her by himself for like an hour or two while my mom's out. So thankfully he didn't have to be too freaked out about it because she's just sleeping. Um, so yeah, we dropped her off and we've got a huge crib. We're at the apartment. My dad's gonna be here soon because he's helping us paint Revlon's nursery. So I didn't get to show you guys yesterday. For any of you that know how much I love to organize my fridge, after shopping, you know that this fridge makes me excited. Look at it. It's all pretty. Oh yeah, we <laughs> filled the whole side with water. Um, we don't really buy a bottle of water, but we can't bring our filter pitcher here yet because we're living at the other place. So, we have water and people, I think last time we mentioned that someone was like, why don't you just drink out of the tap? And tap water here usually doesn't taste very good. So filter, like having a filter, like in your fridge or pitcher filter is pretty normal. Cause it's not tasty. Are you guys ready for a sneak peek? So we're working on the nursery stencil. My dad's here. Uh, the stencil has proved to be more difficult than I expected. <laughs> but we're working through it. It accidentally cracked like on the third one. But we were able to fix it. We just like take to the back. So we're doing that and then we were gonna put the projector wall above here, but it's too big for where we would need to put the projector. So we're gonna hang the projector there and it's gonna be very big here. But by putting it there, we think we're gonna be less distracted by the projector because our couch is going on this wall. So in order to watch a movie or anything like that with the projector, we'll have to pull the, the couch out, which is fine because I think it will keep us from only sitting on our couch watching Netflix all day. <laughs> so, um, but we at least have the projector wall and have the projector. So if we have people over, we can just pull the couch out uh, and watch a movie and stuff. So we're gonna be having quite a big screen, but we'll paint that in a little bit. First, we gotta finish the stencil wall and I've gotta go help my dad do that. So, uh, just went to the car and came back up and brought that thing up. It's really not that heavy. It was just difficult with the size getting it up the stairs. By yourself. Yeah. Do you want so to get some basically, thing? sure. Basically, what I had to do was flip it end over end all the way up the stairs. <laughs> you were careful, right? Yeah, so I was okay. careful. Well, like I'm looking at holes in this. All thing. those holes were there before okay. I did anything. The only thing that happened was one of these came off, oh. and it's in there now. So painting of Revlin's nursery is coming along. I'm going to put this crib together and it should be fun. So Ariana finished the wall in Revlin's room, got the crib all pulled out, all the pieces. I was really expecting more than four pieces, the two like side pieces, the ends and the, the bottom. So I'm not going in there because you guys can't see the, what do you call it yet? The completed wall. So. We decided that this is gonna be the projector wall. It's basically the same design as the other apartment, but something neat, we extended that line onto this wall, and then also down the hall. That still needs to be painted, but. Yeah, so I think that we need, the projector's gonna be over here on the same shelf that it was before. We always do like us assembling things, cause we're new parents, and so today's gonna to be new parents assemble new a crib. Parents. With these five simple pieces, should be pretty easy. Let's get started. She don't know what she wants to be With all the pictures in the magazines Holding hands when she's mad at me Cause she don't wanna go, don't wanna go Met her at Anthropology Purple boots and her golden dreams 
Standing there like a Tennessee queen Singing, don't look at me, don't look at me Singing, oh, oh Won't you help me sing this song? Singing, ee, ee, ee She don't ever want to go to sleep Singing, hey mama, don't want a drum Just a kiss before I leave we're going to reveal the projector wall. Right now it's got tape on it. So we're going to take the tape off and show you guys. Ready? Do it. Finger for my ring. Hey mama, hey, hey mama. 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 Oh, oh. So we are all done. And I don't know. You guys already saw us pulling a little paint off, but this is the finished product. So it's, like I said, basically like it was at the old apartment, but we added a line there. It's a bit thinner. Mm -hmm. And then follow down the hallway as well, well which I think is pretty when neat. When you go like this and then you see the pattern in her, it's cool. But yeah. you just can't see it yet. You're not allowed. Na, 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 na. I think that's going to wrap it up um, over here for today. We got to go pick up Ramlin. No, it, She's been with Tim and Tammy for eight hours. Holy cow. That's definitely the longest we've been without her, so. It'll be nice to see her. It'll be good to pick her up and get to cuddle her close. Ryan insisted on putting the pack and play together, so we're setting up for the baby dedication barbecue tomorrow, because we're having a barbecue here um, afterwards. And he, we're putting out the pack and play now for her nap, because it's right around her nap. And Ryan insisted on doing, putting it up and holding her. I offered to take her. <laughs> and he also asked, said that this was vlogging material. <laughs> you so want to go help him, don't you? Yes. <laughs> Honey, the wheels are caught in each other on this oh, side. Right? Yeah. No, it's okay. He can on this it. side. Oh, yeah. Look at that. <laughs> He wanted no oh, yeah. oh, he actually said no, yeah, he, he did not want help. Come he on. told me to grab the camera and that he did not want help. And he didn't want me to take the baby. <laughs> How's daddy doing, Revlin? Do you need some help, honey? Revlin looks worried. <laughs> Is your daddy crazy? It is warm. <laughs> is your daddy crazy? <laughs> yeah. So it's actually Sunday afternoon, but I'm going to rewind a little bit because we recorded Revlin's baby dedication at church this morning. Uh, she had her baby dedication, so I'm going to play that footage and then the day will kind of continue on. But I wanted to make sure I had like an intro so it wasn't just awkwardly like, hey, you're staring at the front of our church. <laughs> so I will go ahead and play that footage now. <laughs> Their thoughts from scripture, their thoughts from just their own desires, as far as husband and wife, what they would like to see as far as their children and how they turn off to God. So, I forgot what I was going to say. <laughs> um, we really just want to raise Reverend in a way that she doesn't just blindly follow Christ like I've done in my past. Um, we want her to have the desire to follow Christ and develop a personal relationship with him on her own. Um, and really, the baby dedication is a way for us to create public accountability with all of you. Um, that if you see us stepping out of line in that in any way, please come to us and let us know. Because um, we really want to keep this commitment that we're making. The verse that comes to mind is Proverbs 3, 5, and 6. Trust in the Lord with all your heart, and think not on your own understanding. In all your ways, acknowledge him, and he will make your path free. Baby dedication is over. Now we're celebrating, I guess, that we're eating, going to raise our child to know Jesus. That's what we're doing. Hi! Oh, my sister has laryngitis, and so she 
Here, talk. You sound like the girl from Chicago Fire. No, I sound like the girl from Flipping Vegas. <laughs> no, she really sounds like Flipping the girl Vegas. from Chicago Fire. Um, Detective okay. Lindsay. Okay. But we're just eating. I'm going to see if I can sneak like you, sneak you some footage. Hold on. Okay. Um, Hold on. Okay. Okay. Hold on. Okay. Sleeping baby. People like to see line bag openings already. Okay, they're opening line bags. Okay. Okay. Oh, we got a jack. Oh no, it was this one. It was this one. Sally! Sally! Can you tell them we're back home? You want to show them your sunglasses? Oh yeah, styling baby. Are you totally styling? Revelyn's in her crib for the first time. Hi. Are you gonna get your get your foot? Get your foot. Get it. Get your foot. Get it. Get your foot, girl. Get your foot. Get your foot, girl. Get your foot. There you go. Yeah, eat your foot. We're the only parents that take our child on to eat your feet. Get it. Oh. Come on, it's like a milestone. I know, right? Right. We're encouraging it. Eat the foot. Get it. Eat it. Yeah. No. We are learning the tools. So whoops, I'm technically And this is standard. a flathead. <laughs> what? Nothing. Is it not a Phillips? No, it is. You know what I'm doing. What's the other one? A flathead screwdriver. Well, you're using proper name, so I figured you'd say standard. Oh, I don't want to hear someone call it flathead. Everybody calls it flathead. Well, this is a standard then, for real. For, at least that's what I heard rumored and going around the ground. But you will mostly, <laughs> mostly you will hear people say, hand me the flathead. Or hand me the, the, hand me the standard screwdriver, that's like way more work. And See, I always work. considered this one more like standard, and I always thought it was weird when it was flathead. Because flathead, flathead was more popular for a very long time before. Uh, so we're at the new apartment, just hanging out. And we've got friends here. No. <laughs> <laughs> But as you can see, we ordered some pizza, had some dinner. What time is it? Nine. Oh my goodness. Yeah, bedtime. damn, it's bedtime. Yeah, it's time. So yeah, we're probably gonna get packed up and go home. Uh, so, so should I put her in a car home. seat then? Probably. Oh, okay. A good idea. Oh, are you standing? Are you standing up? Oh, look at that big girl. Oh, mm. it's on your shirt. Woo! <laughs> You are so cute. As you can tell, we're back home now. This is gonna end the weekend vlog. Um, I think it was a lot of fun. You barely saw me at all today. Yeah. Um, well, they saw you talk on the podium. Yep. And there were some people that said, asked me if I really forgot what I said. And I did. But, like, right after that, it kicked in and I remembered what I said. <laughs> <laughs> you are so silly. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness, girl. <laughs> she loves the camera. Yeah, she you does. love it. You love the camera. <laughs> 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 Totally laughing, but you didn't take your eyes off the camera. Yep. You're hilarious. <laughs> you are a camera poser. My camera poser. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to end the video. Uh, yesterday's question of the day was favorite childhood toy, I believe, right? Mm -hmm. um, mine would be Legos. 100% most definitely Legos. And she's still staring at the camera. Um, Playmobil. Yeah. Loved me my Playmobil. Mm. So today's question of the day comes from Stephanie Ryans and she said, How and why did you choose the name of your child slash children? And because that limits it to only parents, we're going to expand the question to include pets as well. So how and why did you choose the name of your children and or pets? That's gonna wrap it up for the weekend vlog. Hope you guys enjoyed it. It was a very fun 
and busy weekend for us. Is that right, little one? And obviously it's going to be a busy week ahead trying to get everything moved over to the new apartment. So bear with us and yeah. Hit that uh, hair. Yeah. Hit that thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. And as always, we'll see you guys tomorrow. tomorrow. Bye. Bye. So I'm currently on the back wall of our new apartment. Are you ready? Are you ready? I'm ready. And. Whoa. Wow. There's so many outlets. There's a lot of outlets. So we're going to do a quick tour.